The Truckers Association of Kenya, whose membership comprises of suppliers and transporters of building materials in Mombasa County, is decrying multiple taxation, which it says has greatly affected businesses. Led by their chairman, Crispus Waidaka, the truckers called for the government's intervention so as to at least have their grievances heard. Those challenges we, we face in our country is about the double taxation of the county government. When you are paid in Mombasa, when you go to Kirifi, then you pay. When you go to Mari, when you when you go to another county, you pay those as a double taxation, and the tra and to our transporters are suffering a lot. Sasa tungeomba serikali atutaki mwa na inchi wote ya umie, sababu sisi wote ni sisi na serikali ni sisi na inchi ni yetu. Acheni tukae chini tujue vile ita. Elsewhere. Gatundu South Member of Parliament Moses Kuria has said the proposed budget cuts by the National Treasury will not harm the economy. The legislator, who is a member of the Parliamentary Committee on Budget, said the move by Acting Finance Cabinet Secretary Yuku Riatani will also help in restructuring of government borrowing. That for the first time I have seen honesty coming from the National Treasury. Uh, we are going to have a cut on the budget. Uh, through a supplementary which we are expecting in the next one week. And for the first time we really support him on that, because of not because of just the cuts, but because of the reasons why uh, we are going to have the cuts. He has been big enough and man enough to accept that we have been using misleading estimates for, for, our, for our revenues. It is very good that uh, going forward we are going to have a balanced budget where we live within our means. Meanwhile, Bomet County government in conjunction with the Red Cross Society of Kenya has launched a joint initiative to rehabilitate Nogurwet irrigation project along the Chipkulo River. Bomet Governor Hilary Bachok says the 25 million shillings project will help farmers who in turn will be contributing to the national government vision of the Big Four agenda on food security. Uh, Chakula imetoka kwa hizi zile mashamba ambayo wanatumia irrigation hii ya Nogiriwet. We have watermelon, we've seen cabbages, kuna bananas, uh, French beans at the side na endelewa uh, harvesting. And they are expected to harvest around 2.1 tons. That is a massive harvest. Na nisehe mukadogo tu, meaning once we rehabilitate this section, na more farmers come on board, tutapata chakula kingi, from Nogiri Great Irrigation Scheme. We are committed, kama county government ya Bomet, kusaidia wakulima wetu, and uh, we have made a commitment that we shall expand our extension services, the farmers of Aidike. We shall also try to minimize wastage. Kupitia ile chakula ambayo inearibika, and education stakeholders in the country are being urged to provide quality education to school-going children in a bid to enhance their knowledge in development and research as well as improve their social life. Speaking in Chuka, Tarakanithi County, during a Thanksgiving service, Reverend Julius Wamba called on parents to be role models to their children, especially during the long Christmas holidays. Finally, Environmental conservationists in Baringo County have launched nature excursions in Saimo Forest in a bid to promote preservation of the woodland, which is under threat. The excursion includes a 15-kilometer walk to the peak of Saimo Hills, the highest point in Baringo County, with Kenya Forest Service Officer Jared Bitange blaming illegal loggers for the wanton destruction region, we, of the forest. We are short of rangers. Those that are available are doing their best. But... Uh, you know, we are moving away from the, uh, the time when uh, forest was being protected essentially by an iron, an iron hand. We incorporated the community. For Channel 1 News, I am Emily K. Badi.